Thank you for tuning in to SJ336. Thank John336. This is Stephanie Chanette, and we're on day one, uh, 260, uh, 287, excuse me, which will cover Psalm 67. Scriptural reference today are Psalm 67, the old Psalm, Revelation 7, verse 9 and 10, and then Revelation chapter 19, verse 1 through 7, Micah 4, verse 5, and Joshua 4, verse 10. And we're going to now read Revelation. Oh, so I was going to say, don't let um, somebody in the church. So, okay, let me back a little bit. Okay, you ever hear someone say, you know, Christians this, Christians that, and like complaining? Well, not everyone that claims to be Christian is Christian. Some of them know that they aren't. Some of them don't know that they aren't. And some know that they are not and they are intentionally pretending to be so you have to keep your relationship tight with Christ so that you are working working in discernment now there are times however when the Lord will allow you a blind side he will let these people blindside you some way somehow and it's just something he's working out in you as an individual for the ministry he has planned for you. So don't take it personal. It's like, oh my gosh, I must not really be a Christian. I didn't see that coming. No, just focus. Focus on Christ Jesus. Do the lead. Focus on Him. Praise Him. Study the Word. Praise His name. And focus on Him. Pray always, always, we always pray your spirit. Alright, so Revelation 7 verse 9. Yeah, so I was going to say don't let people you know, they could be in the church and they want you to do something that you know ain't right you know, cover a lie or something like that or do a lie. Mm -mm. Don't. Don't. It's just between you and God, not you and some pretend leader <coughs> in a building. All right, so Revelation 7, 9. After this I beheld and lo, a great multitude, which no man could number, of all nations and kindreds and people and tongues, stood before the throne and before the Lamb, clothed with white robes and palms in their hands. That's the gold right there. That's the gold. A white robe. Let me read 10. And cry with a loud voice, saying, Salvation to our God which sitteth upon the throne, and to the Lamb. Yes, Jesus. And then 19, 1 through 7. Excuse me. And after these things, I heard a great voice of much people in heaven, mm -hmm. saying, Hallelujah, salvation and glory and honor and power unto the Lord our God. For true and righteous are his judgments, for he hath judged the great whore, which did corrupt the earth with her fornication, and hath avenged the blood of his, serv his servants at her hand. <laughs> and again they said, Alleluia, and her smoke rose up forever and ever. And the, and the four and twenty elders and the four beasts fell down and worshipped God, sat down on the throne, saying, Amen, Alleluia. And a voice came out of the throne, saying, Praise our God, all ye his servants, and ye that fear him, both small and great. And I heard, as it were, the voice of a great multitude, and as the voice of many waters, and as the voice of mighty thundering, saying, Alleluia, for the Lord our God, omnipotent, reigneth. Let us be glad and rejoice, and give honor to him, for the marriage of the Lamb is come, and his wife hath made herself ready. Amen. And we're going to go to... Um, the suggested praise song for today, Life Eternally. This is one of my favorite groups. It's uh, called WWMT or Worldwide Methods Tribe. Beautiful testimony with Michelle and her husband. And uh, they're in they're in England. 
Oh, I can't think of it. Manchester. Yeah, Manchester, England. Leaves are rough. The rough leaves are, I guess, like a New York City. Life eternally. WWNT Worldwide Message Drive. YouTube upload dated May 31st, 2014. And, okay, for the entry for today, Psalm 67. In this psalm, we see more expectation of the author's reliance on the interplay between mankind's obedience unto God Almighty, our Creator, and the activity of nature. In verse 1, we find an invocation of God Almighty's blessing, mercy, and glory be, to, to be upon us, His people. Verse 2 explains that as verse 1 is fulfilled, then the answer, of the, the answer to the question of who we are is answered. Verse 3 answers God Almighty's blessing with the provocation that His and all His people will praise Him. Verse 4 indicates that every nation will do well to praise the righteous God, seeing as He does judge justly. Uh, you know, I, no one's going to get away with it. As line 5 restates line 3, one is perhaps given to ask, why? There are already short songs. The Lord our God is magnific magnificent and His handiwork vast. Praise unto Him is to be unceasing. And there are innumerable memor memorials that one may include on a personal and a national level. Perhaps the short psalms come along as this nomadic people encounter unpredictable circumstances for in praise must continue, yet time becomes of the essence also. In verse 6 of this song is when we see the expectation of praising our Lord God. And in verse 7a, verse 7b makes known the end of the expectation. And the whole song reads as if in awareness that end. And the whole song reads as if in awareness of that end. All ought to begin today to yield to his glory and strength. And for the intercessory prayer, dear Father God Almighty, our worthy King, we thank you for your dear and only begotten Son and his completed work of his precious shed blood on the cross at Calvary in Christ Jesus of Nazareth. We thank you for the marvelous things you do, for, unto, in, and through us every day. Please visit all teachers today, Lord God, and grant them extra protection and victory over complacency and hopelessness. And Lord God Almighty, please bless Suriname through becoming the place where soccer champions are born, made, and are trained up, and also proliferative river tourism. In Christ Jesus' holy and precious name we do pray. Amen. I'm anxious to hear some news about what people can find. This is like, I think, the second within the past week where I put in a prayer about the rivers. Some interesting things underneath water. Compressions and whatnot. Okay, I dig this. Have an excellent day. Thanks for tuning in. Like, share, subscribe, and comment below. I monitor all comments.